Bride of Higara. This is Captain Soban of the fleet, Farron Shah. Looks like you could use a hand. Attention all Sobani, pick your targets and engage. Hello everyone, this is Captain Soban. Welcome aboard to Starship and Normal Prize for our monthly channel update. It is November. God, this year is almost over. <laughs> There's two months left until 2023. I'm not ready. I'm not ready for next year. <laughs> Anyways, guys, um, hope you hope your last month went pretty good. Hopefully, you guys had a nice Halloween. Uh, we didn't really do much. I worked, but uh, we were able to like hand out um, uh, candy and whatnot to the kids that visited our store. So that was really nice. And then we had um, some bratwurst and whatnot for dinner. So it, it was a nice night. I, I really enjoyed it. Um, we don't really do much uh, at the house for Halloween because we live out in the middle of nowhere. So unless the cows figure out how to ring the doorbell, <laughs> we won't be having any trick or treaters at our place. So yeah, um, that that was great. Um, uh, that was that was a really nice experience. But uh, for the other stuff that's gone on in my life, um, for those of you that probably know about this, uh, we have a swim spa and we've been using it a lot for the last couple of weeks, and it's been so nice. Um, we've been uh, doing workouts in it, um, and swimming, power walking, um, squats, and like all that stuff that is really, really good for your body. And um, we've been doing really good. Uh, we're, we're starting to get slim. I don't know how well I can show you guys. I don't know how well it looks in this thing, but I feel a lot healthier. And I feel a lot more energetic after uh, working out, um, doing all that stuff. and. Um, we've also switched over to a Nikito low carb diet, which for me has actually been helping me a lot, giving me a lot more energy, and it's been helping my mom a lot because uh, she's been losing weight off of it. So, a lot of things are going really well around here. So, it, uh, last month was a really, really good month for us, and we finally got some rain too because we've been in a drought since uh, the summer. So that's nice. Uh, the ground is no longer um, a solid rock. <laughs> It's just slightly of soft uh, dirt now, which is better than what it was. So yeah, last month was really, really good for us, and hopefully it was a good, good for you guys. Um, but I will let you guys know that I have not really been uploading a whole lot on the channel, and that's because I haven't really been in the mood for strategy and space games. Um, so the channel is going to kind of slow down. Oh, and. I don't know how long you guys can see that, but I also lost a tooth. <laughs> um, I, I've had multiple cavities throughout my, my life, and they've been like capped and root canaled and all that stuff, and uh, one of them finally decided, hey, it's been 20 years, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, um, or 15 years, I'm gonna pop out today. So that's been fun. I've been dealing with having no tooth on, on the top of my, uh, my mouth. <laughs> It's been, it's, it's, uh, it doesn't hurt or anything, which is kind of strange. It just feels weird not having anything there. So, yeah, that's what's been going on. But anyways, what I was saying um, before I interrupted myself, um, I have been working a lot on the, um, the RP series, at least writing the script for the first episode. My goal is to hopefully get this done by the, um, uh, by the end of the month. I'm almost done writing the first episode. In fact, I'll go ahead and show you guys. Boop, boop, boop. Uh, ignore the streaming cat lady in the background. I just uh, I just have strange backgrounds. Anyways, um, so yeah, here it is. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and scroll through this. You guys can pause it if you want to read it yourself. Uh, this is most of the script, I believe, that I have been working on past two or three weeks. My goal is to finish up this entire script and then start recording them and then start actually um, making the uh, scenes and everything that will be part of the video. Because this is going to be more of a movie style video. There isn't going to be a lot of gameplay in this. So I'm excited. I'm excited to get more of it going. So yeah. That's, that's the RP series that I have been working on but anyways um so i've been working on that i've also really gotten into the witch series which uh is apparently an old show that used to come on disney 
um, back in 2004, and it's really it's really good. It's about these uh, five girls who are in high school. I don't know what it is about girls in high school that I really like. Don't judge me. <laughs> I just, for some reason, can connect to them easier. I, maybe it's because I'm a lefty. I just have a backwards brain compared to everyone. But anyways, it's a show about these five girls who are destined to be the next um, witches who are like these, I want to say superheroes? But they have these super abilities uh, where they can control certain elements. So you have one that controls fire, one that controls water, one that controls air, and another one that controls earth. And then you have a fifth one in the middle who is the leader um, um, known as the heart of the clan, and she can amplify the abilities of the other ones. Um, which So it's, it's really cool. And then the story is about how like some sort of... Um, uh, demon society from the middle ages is trying to take over modern earth so they keep going back and forth between like the middle ages and modern earth as they um, try to devise plans and as the girls learn new things about the the demon society they go in to do something against them it's really cool it's it's really really nice has a good sense of humor to it um it's very optimistic and positive which i personally like that's the whole reason i like totally spies <laughs> so i've been getting into that in the past couple of weeks um, what else have I been doing in my personal time? Well, I've been getting a lot more into RPing and RPGs, so I've been playing a crap ton of Skyrim. Uh, for the past two or three weeks, that's pretty much what my free time went to. Uh, I've been thinking about making a series or streaming it, but I haven't quite decided if I want to do that. Because I'm getting to the point where I'm starting to get burned out on that, so if I start a series of it, I'm pretty sure I'm not going to finish it, so... Um, but speaking of that, I'm starting to upload more on the secondary channel because I've been focusing on RP, RPG and um, uh, dungeon crawling um, videos because that's kind of what I've been in the mood for. So yeah, hop on that channel if you guys want to check out more of me. I will still be uploading on the main channel, like I said before. It's just, it's going to be rare. <laughs> I might be doing two up uh, uploads a week until I get back in the... Uh, the mood to um, play space and strategy games. I'm also still really loving my mod that I've been making, but like I said, I've been, I've been kind of burnt out of that stuff, so I've put it on hold for now. I will be back. I'm hoping within two weeks I'll start getting into this to start working on that stuff again, because I, I don't want to work on projects that, um, um, that I'm not in the mood for because they're not going to be good. They're not going to be long lasting. So hopefully, hopefully you guys understand that. But also speaking of that, I've been thinking of a lot of um, um, the differences and combinations between Darth Sovan and Captain Sovan. I'm really, really liking this idea that Captain Sovan is this really, um, really chival, really like knight in shiny armor type of person who will do anything to help anyone and um, help his clan. And um, even if it looks like an obvious trap, he's still going to go for it just to help other people's out. Where Darth Sovan is the exact opposite. He is a very malevolent person. He is very, very selfish. He only does things to help himself and to um, help his, des and to um, like grow his desire to conquer the galaxy. And I love this idea that me, as the person who is recording, has both of these characters like on my shoulders. Like, uh, the Captain Soban is the chival guy on the side telling me what to do, where Dark Soban's on the other shoulder, like, telling me what to do, and I'm kind of the, in the middle guy who's trying to play the game the way I'm supposed to. <laughs> I really, really like that idea, and I might play around with that in future videos. But as it goes for a uh, normal series um, for the channel, the main one, we're going to continue doing what we're doing. Um, I want to probably, we'll probably play a little bit more Star Ruler, but I have found a game that I am interested in recording, so we may cover that. Um, I think it's called Orb. I don't know if any of you guys ever played it, but I just um, was told about it today, and I was like, um, holy crap, this game's pretty cool. It, it came out around the same time, like in between Homeworld 1 and Homeworld 2, and it was supposed to be like a competitor to Homeworld 2, and a lot of uh, um, reviews I've seen said this game was really good, and if you're a fan of those games, you should try it out, so... We might, we might try it out and, and do a couple episodes on the channel. Let me know if you guys will um, uh, actually would like to see that, because I'm curious to see how many of you guys out there actually know what it is, because I don't. This was during the time period when I played nothing but Command & Conquer, so 
<clears throat> I wasn't into like the space stuff and the and the uh, space strategy stuff at the time, so I never even knew about this game. And as for the secondary channel, right now we're we're going to be recording or uploading Fate and Mortal Kombat. Not Mortal. I keep calling to call that game Mortal Kombat, <laughs> Mortal Glory, um, until we beat one of those, which most likely would be Mortal Glory. Um, and then we might get another RPG going on that, that channel. I haven't quite decided. But those are the two main ones I'm thinking of doing, since those, those are the two games that I constantly want to play, so I want to record and upload as much of it as possible, because it'll make good content. Other than that, I don't think there's anything else really going on. Um, our chickens are still alive. They're not laying as much as we want them to, which kind of sucks. We're kind of we don't really know why, but um, I, my dad wants to get rid of them and get a new batch. It's an idea, <laughs> but I think we're actually going to start containing them because it, it, I think the reason they're not laying is because they're they're free roaming too much, so they're not um, staying within their area and getting into things that are probably not good for their body, so they're not laying as much as they need to. So, or as much as we want them to. Because we, we have about seven chickens, I think. No, we have eight chickens. And we get about two to three eggs a day. So, <laughs> we're supposed to be getting as many as you have chickens. We're supposed to be getting seven to eight. So, yeah, we're not too sure what's going on with that. But hopefully we can figure it out. Other than that, I don't think there's anything else really going on. Dogs are still being dogs. Um, my parents are still, you know, working on the farm. If anyone owns a farm, you know that it's, you never really run out of things to work on the farm. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I think that's about it. So I hope you guys enjoy this. Uh, please leave a like if you do. If you like what I do, consider subscribing, and I'll check you guys out in the next video. Until then, this is Captain Sopon signing out. Baker have arrived. Emergency hyperspace procedures initiated. The mothership must survive.